the first question is from megha megha gupta you are requested to unmute and ask the question to sir good morning sir my name is megha gupta and i'm from the department of journalism and mass communication so as you are known as the father of modern financial derivatives in india and are considered as one of the foremost experts in financial market policies it and so much more what would you say has been your greatest accomplishment in a way as i told you uh, like sachin said uh, your 100 centuries don't matter the next moment yes. is what matters right and so uh, i don't stay on my laurels uh, i don't even think those are my achievements those are achievements of the society of the teams you work with um uh, and uh, in some ways you were uh, lucky to be part of uh, that process uh, that activity at that time uh, of course you get uh, personally benefited uh, uh, in terms of getting knowledge uh, many uh, things which i have done i have not uh, got much money out of it but the knowledge doesn't go away uh, and that is what i would say uh, the greatest uh, achievement of mine has been to understand uh, not to be envious of anyone uh it is important to go on your path uh continue uh, your work continue to learn from others be useful rather than be negative in your mind or even in activities and whatever way uh, you can do that uh, of course uh, in terms of the technological situations i think uh, doing the first uh, commercial satellite telecom network for india two way satellite basically what you are used to today uh, uh, the mobile yes. phones and all those were days they were not there and we used to send a lot of satellites on top uh, to uh, literally 36000 kilometers but we never used them for commercial purposes uh, and i was 25 year old those days i was not trained to be a telecom engineer i was actually a mechanical engineer and i had to learn through the books i still have those books uh, and it worked and it just gave me that idea uh, by that whatever i learn uh, and i was not a great student in iid and i am because of my lack of uh, knowledge of english Uh, but whatever i can learn by reading books i it, it actually still works uh, and those were uh, what i call revelations to me and they still continue to uh, sort of uh, guide me that anything is possible when i set up uh, the screen based trading for india which again uh, first time uh, it actually uh, was used uh, nobody actually gave it even a uh, iota of uh, imagination of success that this is a bureaucrat driven uh, exchange it's not going to be successful by right there uh, and uh, similarly uh, i mean i was not a chemical engineer but i was ranked among the the best it that is a cio chief information officer of chemical industries in the world uh, and so uh, there are literally I mean, if i look back uh, there might be probably few thousand things i have been uh, I, mean, i would be proud of but more importantly how i give back Uh, to the society how do i uh, use my understanding my knowledge uh, whatever little money i have uh, for the benefit of uh, the community around to the society and uh, also ensure and uh, basically motivate all of you that uh, india's best time is yet to come what we could achieve out of nothing we had nothing we i mean i came with a, a what i call uh, a tin bag i still have that bag in my house Uh, to mumbai to study uh, and today uh, what i have achieved is largely because of technology when we were young uh, there was, if you had to become rich uh, you had to have a huge amount of wealth coming from your parents or you had to do really great bad kill somebody or do some scandal to become greatly rich today uh, last 30 years my own uh, life tells you that by doing good by just uh, working in technology working ethically working working morally you can become rich and the world is becoming faster and faster in terms of technological innovation so you won't require a lot of capital to become rich you will require a lot of brains a lot of hard work and very little capital uh, and that's where i think the time of india uh, is yet to come uh, we were in a way uh, the stepping stones for all of you uh, but basically have that confidence that today better than ever before you have a chance to become extremely rich using your brains your hard work you don't have to do anything unethical immoral and those are the achievements i think my generations did uh, for all of you thank you so much sir for your words 
Thank you.